With your one minute closing remark, why people should vote for you. Okay, um, I guess um, I think people should vote for me because of my experience and knowledge. Um, I think I will encourage uh, our board to um, keep taxes in line, uh, allow people to keep more of the money they earn. Uh, when people spend money and our businesses expand, that's what really expands the economy, not government taxes, government spending. Um, that's what really creates jobs and expands the economy. Um, I think we look at some new budgeting policies. Uh, we, we looked at making some major changes in the land use plan and in the conservation ordinances. Uh, these changes are long overdue. Um, there's some serious, I think, violation of proper, property owners' rights in California. We need to fix those violations. Um, I think we need to spend more time in, on uh, focusing on inclusive and improving our public works and public infrastructure. Okay, yeah, thank you. Sean, one minute. Um, I think I can contribute. I've been a resident a long time. I've been floating through for a long time. I haven't contributed in the past because my focus was in building a business and doing other things. When I decided to run as a trustee, the first question I got from everybody is, why would you want to do that? And I think that's sad, quite frankly. So in the last few months, I've met with the Conservancy Board at their meeting. I've met with the fire chief and toured through the buildings and pelted him with questions nonstop for an hour and a half. I've met with representatives of the sewer district. I've met with representatives of the planning commission. And a meeting with the, went at 6 a.m. and met with the highway department and asked them a bunch of questions. And then I went um, a meeting with the police union people as well. That's all on my time. Can you imagine what I'd do if I actually had the job? Over to you, Wendy, one minute. Thank you. Okay. Um, I, I would like to be reelected to the board because I think I fit a niche that isn't represented otherwise. In other words, I'll be the first to admit that I have trouble reading financial reports. I ask stupid questions because I want to know the answers. But I have a, a different kind of background. I have the background in the environment. I have the background in um, grassroots organizing, which I think needs to be done on Douglas Avenue. Um, and of course, now I have four years experience on the board. And I think that we should have a diversity on the board of, of interests and abilities. And so I think I represent an ability that needs to be there. Thank you. Finish up with you, Tom, one minute. Well, again, I'd like to thank everybody for being here tonight. I also have spent considerable time uh, out at the village hall uh, interviewing the uh, firemen, and uh, I was, uh, uh, I've also gone through the highway department and the building department. Uh, there's some excellent people we have employed in Caledonia. Uh, I hope that you vote for me, though, because of my experience in commercial and industrial uh, site development. And it's because I was always on the other side of that. Now, on the flip side of the coin, I'm sure I can bring a lot of value to Cal Caledonia in that process. Thank you. Okay, thank you, candidates. Let's give them a hand for working here.